Hey, thanks for joining us right here on Iron Pro's Construction Tech Talk. We are doing one of our We Talk to Smart People episodes, and I'm here with Ro Boccia, the CEO of Plan Hub. How's your day going? Sir? It's going great. Thanks for having me. This is oh, awesome. Anytime. So we're here at Advancing Pre-Construction. We're going to find out what Plan Hub does for pre-construction. So, Ro, I was... Yeah, you know, doing some homework on the product and you know it seems like you've got a couple of different footprints that are really interesting from the standpoint of pre-construction estimating and a bunch of other product categories that we have here on Iron Pros. Uh, one of them is you know really the you know the, the bidding process but also uh, you have a market what it what looks to me like a market data service of available projects and contractors so you know you have a community yes sir uh what can you tell me about that community how long has it been there and and, and how many uh contractors and bidding opportunities are we talking about yeah no that's actually the, the most fun part of our our platform we are a SaaS platform and all that means is we have what your typical um, bid management tool, pre-construction tool, and platform will provide. We're very, very maniacally focused on pre-construction and streamlining that. I'll get to the community part, but real quickly. On the pre-construction platform, we cover everything from discovering the projects to sending out the ITBs in our world, invitation to bids, sending out the bids to subs, subs, subcontractors replying to those bids with a proposal, managing, you as a GC, managing and comparing those bids using our bid leveler, and of course analytics on top of it. Okay. So all those tools are there. What sets us apart from you know um, other technologies out there is this community aspect that you just yeah. talked about. We have about 350,000 subcontractors in our platform. 350,000. Yeah. We've got 55,000 general contractors yeah. using our platform, and we've got close to uh, 10,000 suppliers on our platform. And you know, I was I tell my team, um, software building a software is actually not that hard. Sure, it can take you six months from two, anywhere from six months to two years to build it out. It's this community that takes yeah. years to build. Because not only is it just inviting someone and having them partake into our platform, but how often do they come back? Yeah. How often do they transact? How often do they talk to other participants? And that's really the most exciting part. We, I've here even, I've spoken to general contractors where they're going from one region to another and they don't know any subs out there in that yeah. region. Someone like going from California to New York. They need an expansive network or a directory of subs in New York that is vetted, qualified, that they can send out bids to, and they can receive bids and communicate with that. We help with that. Yeah, yeah, and th you're not the only ones with this idea, of course. You know, Pro the first ones. I think has uh, yeah, a, a, a community that they're growing as well. But uh, you know, how far of a head start do you have on? About nine years. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that's a bit. Yeah, uh, yeah, and look, the, the the market is so big. I, I don't I don't find anyone here um, as competitive. Uh, you know, coming with a competitive spirit. This is the market is so big. There's just so much room for for all of us to grow. The goal here is really how do we streamline? How do we make it so simple that it's a no-brainer? I don't want to hear from GCs that I have to train the estimators to use yeah. our platform. It should be that simple. Yeah. One other uh, interesting observation I had here, even after talking to a bunch of GCs, I, I found them in kind of two you know, buckets, if you will. One is, um, highly sophisticated GCs, big GCs, yeah. are still using spreadsheets. Yeah. And and one, uh, you'll get a kick out of this. One GC actually told me they're using sticky notes uh, to manage their bids and to get and, and, and manage their subcontractors. That was funny. So that's that's one bucket. And the second bucket is they're using highly sophisticated, customized platform. Yeah. And both of these people I've talked to, they're like, well, this side, I have so many mouths and bells and whistles that it's so hard for me to train a new estimator or a new person who's going to manage all of that. I don't need all of that, and it's expensive to maintain. I'm not in that business. This side, they're like, well, I think we want to be able to scale, and yes, the spreadsheets are working, but we need something newer of this day and age. And we sit right there in the middle. We're so easy, spreadsheets on steroids. Anybody who's known or know how to use spreadsheets can use us. Anybody that doesn't want all these bells and whistles, all this functionality, can use us as well. Yeah, yeah. So when it comes to the type of contractor is going to be like a real natural fit. You know, would that very large general that in our you know you know top you know 100 contractor be the fit, or are you, are you better down market? Yeah. So who's the fit? 
No, good question. Um, look, I'd like to say that it's, um, you know, um, I guess every spectrum, but you're, you're, you're right. It's a good question from an ideal fit perspective. Let me talk about subcontractor. Anyone who's doing two million in revenue, for example, all the way to 200 is a great fit for us. Okay. Anyone that gets into like 500 million plus, can we solve their problems? Yes, we're gonna have to do custom integrations because a lot of those times, they're using a specific um, version of the ERP and that could be Sage 1.5 to Sage 5.6 and we have to yeah. figure out where the integration goes. Yeah. But for the most part, anywhere in between two to 200 million in revenue on the sub side. On the GC side, um, we have different versions of the product. So we have a free version for the product of the product that anybody is doing less than 10 to 15 million in revenue yeah. and they don't need all the sophisticated tools like bid leveling and, and whatnot or expensive uh, directory. They yeah. can they can use that, but we a lot of our GCs are in the range of I would say fifty to like a two billion. Um, that's usually our sweet spot. Yeah, yeah. So you know, you know, after a while, someone's hearing you talk about the products. They man, you're a better salesperson than anyone I've ever seen. You got me. I got to get some of this into my business. Yeah, how much stuff going to cost me? How do you figure out what you're going to charge people? Look, um, I don't know what you're paying today, but um, any of the big guys like here I talked about, we're going to cost you one-fifth of that. Uh, and like I said, we're focused only on pre-construction. Uh, we might not have 100% of what they have, but feedback that I have gotten is nobody needs 100% of what they have. Yeah. We've got 80 to 90% of the functionality that is right here, uh, and we've got 80% more of what this was, which is yeah. spreadsheets. Um, how much do we cost? Uh, how, much, how much does it cost? From a sub perspective, if you're a subcontractor, it cost, it can cost, any, depending on how big you are and how many seats you need and the functionality, it can cost literally anywhere between $2,500 a year to $25,000 a year. Now if you want specific data with API, um, like I said, all the data sources that we have, at, you know, 350,000 subs and close to 100,000 projects a year, that will cost you a little bit more, but depending on the size Are or the custom. Are you by by the project, by uh, construction revenue, or you know what's the metric that you're basing that on? Yeah, it 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 it's actually neither of those. Um, you know, one thing I take really a, a ton of pride in. Uh, I did say usage and I'm sorry, number of seats, but for us, you can get our platform and and give it to hundreds of users if you want. We're not going to charge you for seats. That's one big differentiation. For us, it's really what level of functionality do you want from us? Meaning if you want all of our data, of course it's going to cost you a little bit more. If you want all of our functionality, it's going to cost you a little bit more. How many users use that functionality? That's up to you, and that's a big advantage. Okay. Um, so the, it, it's more about how much functionality you want, you want to yes, sir. subscribe to? Okay, and... Sorry, one other thing that I want to answer that. On the GC side, the sub side was anywhere between 2,500 to 25,000. On the GC side, it varies again. It can be anywhere between 5,000, which like I said, it's close to one-fifth or one-third of the big guys here, um, all the way to 50,000, just depending on where you're at. Yeah, yeah, and I'll consider later when I edit that out because this stuff is going to live in a Google SERP for a good long time, and you know, sometimes we get calls, oh, you wrote about our product four years ago, our prices have changed. But, you know, chances are those are big, wide enough categories. Yes, we're I mean, we're not, we're not Costco, sorry, we cannot have yeah. the, you know, the, the same stuff for, I don't yeah. know, 10 years, the same price. Yeah. But yeah, uh, for the most part, we're very, very cost effective, um, and very competitive. Uh, when it comes to that. Now you got me thinking about that Costco roasted chicken. Right? <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> yeah, I really appreciate you taking some time for to let me brain dump you. We'll connect more later and we'll you know, take you through the full Iron Pro's discovery process and give someone a very deep and intimate idea of what you're doing so that you can make some new friends faster. I really appreciate it. Yeah. Thanks for having me. This was fun. Yeah, and if you like this kind of thing, if you like hearing from Ro and people who are at the heart of what's going on in construction technology, keep on coming back here to Iron Pro's and we'll talk soon.